Hello, this is not a spring chicken today. Okay, I mean, some days it's shiny at the beach and sometimes it's not, but boy, news is, well, let's just say certainly going all over the place with the market that was, let's just say, all over the map with a roller coaster week. Plus, so, yes, the Republican, <laughs> Republicans in Iowa. But we have Old Cam here with OFN and News Video Web with comments on the headlines of today. And you know the market is phony when the retail store report record set, re, reports record sales at the same time that people say they aren't shopping. I know. It's just that they're... Uh, and then they, after the day was over, they paraphrased it saying the sales were not as good as what we originally thought they were. After the week is over, they say After the sales over. were not as good as we originally thought. First of all, they missed, they, they, okay, the sales were records, but then after the time is over, they said they all missed their expectations, which means they were worse than it could have been. I mean, we go into grocery stores, we're going to shopping. Okay, we're right now, I mean, because, you know, we're actually recording this at McDonald's, folks. There's nobody here. On an afternoon by the beach, is there? Well, yeah, that's true. <laughs> and there's nobody going to into, go into the shopping centers. Look at how many spaces are available at shopping centers. Well, actually, one of the things I'm noticing is there's not as many people in the stores, and they aren't buying as much. I mean, we go in. We don't. We don't come out with big purchases anymore. I mean, we're no longer buying the bigger piece of equipment. We're buying the. We're buying the pieces of equipment that are more affordable. Then the more expensive pieces, actually, sometimes we're a lot better off buying the more affordable ones now, but um, it just, people don't have any money. I mean, they said, this is what they said. The polls said there is the lowest confidence in this country since Jimmy Carter was president, and the fact that people are holding on to their money because they're afraid of what's going to happen next. Mm. And only Obama can save the economy from Bush and the Republicans. I know. I mean, th th this is really starting to get very worn with a lot of the Democrats. Bush is not the president, and the Republicans aren't in charge, no matter how he puts it. They forget that one? They, Bush, he is the president. He, he keeps trying to, well, uh, this is his great one. I mean, I, I did hear one of his people, one of the, the very left-wing liberals, he said, this really sounds lame. When he could, when his main response was, I didn't know that Bush and the Republicans had left such a mess. I didn't know that we didn't have shovel-ready projects. I didn't know that the law says that you can't, you know, that if you dedicate the money to here, it can't be used there. They said the president is never supposed to not know, even if he doesn't. And factory growth slows, cast a shadow on the economy. You know, that came also out after they said they had record sales and would have to be doing, they'd have to be reordering everything because of record sales. Oh, really? No, they don't, not only don't have record sales, factories aren't producing anything. They do have lower unemployment figures, though. Uh, not because people are being hired, it's because they're falling off the rolls, folks. And GOP debate hitting hard at each other and Obama. Well, actually, they even every now and then remembered Obama. Oh. <laughs> Mostly it was like uh, the, the Pelani trying to destroy. Okay, what it was is the Republicans are never going to nominate. Hell will long freeze over before the Republican establishment is going to nominate a woman, so they all decide to go after her to get rid of Bachman. You know, but see, mm -hmm. the problem is, is now it looks like Palin is going to be into the mix again. So, oh, really? And she will take the Tea Party vote away. I'm looking at a. At the, she's probably going to. Wait, gonna, wait is yeah. she really going to run Republican? She's going to decide who's going to run on a Republican ticket. That's about what that amounts to. Oh uh, well, you know. And a threat to bring down Facebook posted an online video. Oh yeah, all because somebody was going. The hackers that have been hitting everybody else are getting ready to hit Facebook. You mean these same ones that were probably doing Sony and yeah, who else? Yeah, the, the federal government, Iran. Maybe they've hacked Iran too. They shut off the nuclear reactors in Iran for a while. The show could be done. So. Oh really? Yeah. Um, and Dow up 423 as Wall Street. <laughs> Wall Street because of Obama's policy. I know. They said that his his. I love that that his policies of making shared sacrifice. You know, as with a balance and shared sacrifice, meaning that the people that have the money share every bit of money they have with the people that don't want to work. And that's, that's you know, like everybody thought that was sort of a farce, him and his shared sacrifice. Well, you know, Amber, I liked your, your discovery of the polls. That what is the percentage of people that don't pay taxes? 51%. And what is the percentage of people that think taxes should be raised? On the wealthiest, 51%. 
and that are the coincidence. Mm -hmm. And it's their pollsters that are coming up with those figures. And China's first aircraft carrier holds maiden sea trial. Well, you know, because they're figuring they're, they're okay, they know Obama is pulling back. Obama and the Democrats are pulling back. They're going to concede the Asia to the Chinese very shortly. Oh, really? Yeah, but uh, they said with, uh, that, that we got to get these people to do more. Well, they don't have navies according to the their constitution prohibits navies. So there, if their constitution prohibits navies, and the Chinese are all over the all over Asian waters with their fleet, uh, who's going to stop them then? Mm. No one. And Governor Rick Perry is running for president. You know, like they said, that's another big yawn. The guy, the, basically, he is the I'm not oh, I'm not Romney vote. Because exactly. Romney is not going to get the nomination. I don't know where Romney, he lives in this, this alternate universe of thinking a guy that raised taxes in Massachusetts, that created Romney care, and will not admit that it was wrong, is going to be the nominee. That's mm -hmm. not going to happen. It's, it's about this, you got the same chance as that happening as the Republicans supporting Hillary Clinton for their presidential nominee. Well, you never know. Sometimes hell does freeze over. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Police man hid mother's body to collect benefit checks. I don't see what's unusual about that. I, mean, I was going to say, I thought that happened more. That's, that happens all the time. That's been happening since they created Social Security. Our coupons, what happens to when a person dies, they don't cut their benefits coupons from um, corporations anymore. Oh, and for all you people, th those people don't actually get money from corporations. Corporations only put money in the people that live in Knob Hill or in Martha's Vineyard. The people, you know, your grandma that has a little coupon that she cuts and goes gets a dividend thing on, mm -hmm. that doesn't happen according to the, the, the chairman of the Democratic National Committee. Really? Right. Um, and after riots, the UK politicians inch toward the blame game, and all they know is that Bush and the Republicans are involved. Yeah, because uh, Bush set the set them on this path with his uh, massive spending. He has the place with four hundred and fifty billion dollars in debt, folks. Four hundred and fifty billion. Barack Obama seven trillion. Oh, but the problem is, like I keep trying to explain to people that most Democrats have to take at least one shoe off and all of their fingers in order to count to one. Oh, you are so bad. Well, they can't count, can they? Okay, if if you were left 450 billion, how many, how, okay, how many times does 450 billion go into one trillion? Okay, okay, okay. Twice. Obama yeah. spent 14 times that amount. Well, you know, some of it didn't count. <laughs> no, but if you can only count to one, well, let's see. I oh, okay. He did this, but I only did one. And <laughs> Israel Prime Minister ready to discuss border package official. No, they're not. They're not going to. They're not going to discuss anything that gives up the the protection of Israel to the um, Palestinians. Like that's going to happen. Afghan witnesses Chinook ablaze when it crashed. Yeah, because okay. Um, the one thing I would not want to do in a war zone would ride into something that a guy with a bow and arrow can bring down. So they got armor. Well, they don't have armor everywhere, and all you have to do is to hit an arrow. You know, I shot an arrow into the air, and it fell down a Cobra helicopter. That's how it was done in in, in Vietnam, from what I understand. Oh, really? You have you have tribesmen with blow darts bringing down helicopters. Well, they're good. Yeah. Well, no, the helicopters are very, very thinly armored in places. Now you oh, really? Just hit one of them. So. Oh, I thought it was. You were kidding. No, they're, they're, they're oh. okay. Uh, helicopters that got off the most dangerous thing in the world to fly in and out of a battle with. Mm -hmm. It gets you in there fast, but you may never get out. Oh, part. Of, well, that's why they're light, right? Yeah. Israel Prime Minister ready to discuss border package they, official. I know. Uh, Okay. Like that so much, I know. Twice, so. And gang member executed in Texas for killing two rivals. Yeah, but they wanted the uh, Democrats have all once again said that he, if the other people hadn't have been better off than him, he wouldn't have done it. And if they'd have simply gave, divided the wealth up, this is one criminal, of course. If one criminal hadn't have been more wealthy than another criminal, he'd still be alive today. Mm -hmm. I love that. And oh, yeah. <laughs> Obama vows new ideas to boost jobs and slams Congress. Okay, uh, basically he is the outsider. <laughs> they love that he's the outsider. He's trying to stand up against those evil members of Republican Party, those people that don't. That basically, okay, all the ratings agencies in the rest of the world should stop spending. Obama's idea is basically 
what they said is that we need to increase social spending, we need to increase infrastructure spending, we need to raise taxes, and oh, we got to have green jobs, green industry, uh, uh, you know, high-speed rail, which basically came to a screeching halt in China yesterday entirely. They're pulling all the trains really? because they don't work. We got to go green like Spain. Spain is busted. We got to spend tons of money on infrastructure. Italy is busted, and. Uh, and that's Obama's new idea is to put one million people to work immediately. He would even come yeah. back from his vacation. Well, because he's doing like 40-some fundraisers during vacation, so. Uh-huh. Yeah, talk about a vacation. Animonte bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, I like this one. Getting old is like going on a blind date. You have absolutely no idea how this is going to end. <laughs> okay.